I was in the process of installing another Konki, which is the one up here. And this Konki is called Aureola Phantom. And it's already downloaded in the dot .aureola. But the thing is, some of the Konkis do require a specific kind of uh, Konki because of the graphical representations that are in here. So some of them do not require it, but when on Arch and on Tergos, you need to install something more. And let's do that together now. In this here, in the LX terminal, we can tell him that we want a Konki that's ready for Lua. And we need this one, the Konki Lua NV. Maybe this one is possible too, but seeing the, the number, and the number of votes. I want the 1.10 and maybe this one can work as well but in the past the zero so the concrete Lua NV has served me well so I'm going to use this one. So the program Konki that we have is going to be replaced. Edit, no, no. The Konki Lua, the, the Konki we have because we do have a Konki is going to be replaced with this kind of conky, which is capable of showing graphical rings, clocks, uh, these kind of things. And this particular one that we want to install, Phantom, is looking like this. So it has these bars going up and down. So we definitely need something graphical to support this. And that's why we're installing this program. Let's wait for the installation together. Everything is ready. He's asking me, Konki Lua NV and Konki are in conflict. Do I remove the Konki? And I say yes to him. I say yes to the installation of the Lua NV. And then we have to kill all the Konkis and try the gun, Konki. And now we have this little icon up here still see for one reason or another that um, it's not in order uh, that I mean the, the, the font here is not the way it's supposed to be in clicking F4 I have set it this system PC man FM I have set it here preferences advanced Alex terminal when I press F4 now, I have Alex Terminal in this directory. So let's reinstall it just to be safe. Yeah, that's normal. There are stuff in there that he does not know. That's maybe the issue why things go wrong. So go to the home folder, go to the Confi, go to, to the Conky. Here is my Conky, nowhere else. And let's put it here. So these are this is the Konki Conf. The only thing that, that really bugs me a little bit is um, this here. Eh? If we do one enter more and save, then we have these text a little bit more where it should be. So one of the lines up here does not work because of maybe Dropbox. I did not install Dropbox. Um, the cinnamon version, of course. There is no cinnamon version inside Arch Linux, in Linux Mint, yeah, but not here. So maybe that's already the reason why everything uh, skips a line. So that's that. Uh, we have our Konki theme and we have our look. This is the look we have now. And we can change, we can already a little bit lower, would be more interesting, but that's just extra pixels down and that's it. That concludes this tutorial.